Hey everyone, happy Friday. This is Mary Beth McGandrews, Editor-in-Chief of Dread Central, and this is Dreadlines, the weekly news show where we share with you the top horror headlines. This week, we're covering The Blair Witch Project, Monstrous, Salem Horror Fest, Bria Grant's new film, I Fucked Up the Order. This week, we're covering The Blair Witch Project, Monstrous, Salem Horror Fest, Dash Camp, and Bria Grant's new film. And don't forget to stick around until the end for my movie pick of the week. Found footage fans rejoice! We may just be getting a Blair Witch Project franchise reboot. This 1999 iconic film took the world by storm and brought found footage onto the map, and we might be getting a new one. So if you weren't a fan of the 2016 Blair Witch, who knows, this might just be what you're looking for. And Twitter is rallying behind Jed Shepard, one of the writers of the pandemic film host, to be the director. So keep an eye out on Dread Central for more news about who will be directing the project. Christina Ricci's new film Monstrous has a brand new trailer. The aquatic horror film set in the 1950s is set to hit theaters and VOD on May 13th, and we are so excited to see Ricci back in the horror genre, especially after her iconic performance as Misty in Yellow Jack. After a year-long hiatus, Salem Horror Fest is finally back. This incredible film festival, which is all about uplifting queer and underrepresented voices in the genre, will be coming back April 20th through the 30th. No longer in October, festival director Kay Lynch is looking to make the festival even more accessible than it already is. We are so excited for this festival to be back. Rob Savage's latest found footage film, Dash Cam, is coming to theaters this June. Now there's a new trailer that just dropped so you can get a taste for what's to come in this controversial film that generated quite some buzz during its international premiere Toronto Film Festival last year. The film is officially hitting theaters in VOD on June 3rd. Coming off the success of films like Lucky and 12 Hour Shift, Rhea Grant is back in the directing chair with her upcoming film, Torn Hearts a horrific take on the country music scene. In the film, two aspiring country singers meet their idol, Harper Dutch, who they hope can help them make it in the business. But Harper has some very sinister intentions. The film is set to hit digital and VOD on May 20th. And now it's time for my movie pick of the week. So this week, my movie pick is The Northman that is playing in theaters now, and I just want everyone to go see it because it is a $90 million budget art house film about Vikings and revenge. This is the third feature film from director Robert Eggers, who is responsible for films such as The Witch and The Lighthouse. Alexander Skarsgård channels Viking madness. Nicole Kidman is an icon. Anya Taylor-Joy is a scary witch. I mean, what is not to love? And there's blood and guts everywhere. You need to check it out in theaters and showcase that these kinds of movies can make big money. Please and thank you. And if you need more convincing, you can read my review over on Dread Central. And that about does it for this week's Dreadline. Thank you everyone so much for watching. And if you want more Dread Central, make sure to follow us on social media. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. We also have a podcast network. Listen to all of our podcasts on the Dread Central Podcast Network wherever you find your podcasts. And if you want more horror news, make sure to subscribe to our newsletter, The Harbinger. And if you haven't watched it yet, check out our latest release, Midnight, a South Korean serial killer film. Thanks again for watching, and have a happy Friday!